to here and welcome back to some more War Thunder. Now, I did say in the M3 Lee video that I was going to be making more, well, videos on War Thunder, and this time it's going to be live games. I'm actually going to start recording some War Thunder games, specifically live games. I'm going to be using my favorite Tiger 2 that never existed, hence the title, which is this bad boy right here, the Tiger 2 10.5 centimeter KWK, which is just Germany's weird way of saying this is a 105 millimeter long barreled cannon. They shoved it in a Tiger II, at least that was the proposal for it, and, you know, beefed it up a little bit. Uh, also, for backups, we're going to be taking the Tiger IIH and the Yag Tiger itself. We have some two CAS planes here, which is the Ta 154A1, and then we have the HE 219A7, which I will be making a video separately on these two, which have quickly became my favorite German CAS in the game, especially for 4.3s. I know I made a video a while back talking about how, uh, I think it was the BF109 G2, or it was one of the Fs that I said was my favorite and the best German CAS in the game. Uh, but I have now since changed that, and my new favorite and the best in my opinion, at least in 4.3, are these two planes right here. So, without me blabbering away, let's get to using my favorite Tiger 2. Apologize for the mouse clicks, by the way. That's an IS-6. Try, still trying to work out the, the audio to get that perfect mix so you guys aren't hearing my clicks, but hearing me. Uh, okay, that's a bulldog. I did not expect to hit that, if I'm honest. B is being capped, and I'm the only tank this far up, except for Homeboy in the SPAA. Some kind of T-34, it sounds like. At least a Russian vehicle with that engine. Hoping it's not a big boy. No, it's an... I can't remember what that's called. Starts with a Z, doesn't it? Definitely should have aimed for the turret. I also hear a Pershing moving up. Okay, that's dead. Okay, it was a 2S, a 2S, 3M. For some reason, I thought it started with a Z. For some reason. Okay, I'm wondering. If we should ship the English. I'm wondering if we should push the left here. We'll try it. Yep, there's that. Is that a Sherman? Does he know I'm here? He knows I'm here, right? I don't want to shoot him here. I want him to expose himself a little bit more. Oh, hello, STB. Oh, there's 250 kills. Oh, no. He's dead. Okay. So another vehicle right there. Okay, he took that out. Swing the turret before we move forward. He bounced. It's, it's, it's a Sherman Jumbo 76. For some reason, it's not as deadly as the normal Jumbo. Okay, he needs help repairing. Let's re repair him. Again, I'm really hoping this is recording right because. The games I recorded on Shadowplay, those were some really good games. And I didn't feel like editing it to put it in front of this video. Because it, it just, it was horrible. And it wouldn't have really made sense. It's a bummer too, because I recorded the Tiger 2 105 video. Then I recorded a video using the Tiger 1. In both of those videos, I got a lot of kills. We got an IS-1? Is he pushing up? No, he knows I'm here. Does he know I'm here? Now you gotta show me that- No, no, no. Give me that lower glacis, buddy. Okay. I'm gonna do something stupid that's more than likely gonna get me killed. Okay, well, I got him killed. That's a... 
Well, I didn't think I could pen him from the front until he did that. So he's dead. That was a M26. I almost said M46 for some reason. Revenge bomb? Corsair with no bombs. Okay, we're good. So much debris and war that's an ASU-85. Either I went through him or missed. I wouldn't do that, JPZ. Yeah, we're definitely up tiered. We got 7 3 Mr. ASU. Oh, I'm dead. Ah, oh, shit, IS-3. We'll kill him first. Since he's got heat FS, I'm pretty sure the ASU-85 has uh, heat FS. Oh, fuck me. That's going to one-tap me anywhere. Not if I do that. I love the new crew sounds. The crew sounds were great. a great addition to the game. Oh, that was an IS-2, by the way. I thought it was an IS-1. I couldn't see the muzzle break. Okay, a bulldog killed home. Oh, God. I don't know. IS-3 bounced off my turret. Did he hit my turret? Yeah, he bounced off my turret. That's... I got lucky. Because even hitting a weird angle, he would have penned. I should probably go get a crew member. I hear a tank to my right. Let's be smart about this. Let's smoke it. Sounds like a Russian tank. It sure is. That's an object. I cannot kill him. I am kind of fucked. And I got a small boy. Yep, right there. Okay, he's dead. I gotta worry about the IS-3, though. IS-3 might come down this main road. He can definitely pen me. I'm sorry, team. I'm annoying you, but... Oh, uh, we traded. Good trade. Okay, so we ended up getting first place, 5,300 research, 57,000, give or take, actually. Uh, lions, bunch of our medals, 8 kills, 8 crits, 16 hits. The reason why I'm playing the Tiger 2, specific, well, not, yeah, specifically the 105 version. If you guys remember, if anyone's a returning subscriber watching this video, I made a video a long time ago. What are you? Bulldog. I shot too high on that one. Let's just let him hit me. Give him false sense of security. Seven hundred. Let's just let's just do a ranging. I'll let him drive forward, fire the shot, he's dead. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Um, but yeah, there's a reason why I'm playing the Tiger 2 105, and that is because, and again, if you remember the video I made a while back, I think it was a couple of years now at this point, uh, I was talking about Gaijin, the people who made War Thunder, for those of you who are unaware, uh, to put the Panzerkampfwagen 7 Lurver into War Thunder. And I'm talking about both versions. Technically, if you dig a little deeper, there's three versions of the Lurver. There's like a like a howitzer version. There's a heavy version, which was called the the um the Schwer version. Uh and then the light version, which I think light in German is Lichter or Lair, one of the two. 
Um, the light version had the 88, which is what the Tiger II had. And then the Schreyer version had the 105. And then I believe the howitzer... I saw somewhere that they, they made a howitzer version that was like a 128 howitzer, which is insane. Um, that one could be like 100% faked. Um, but there are at least two confirmed, at least, blueprints of the Lurver. The 88 version and the 105 version. And it's my favorite... It's my favorite non-produced only blue printed that guy's gonna die German vehicle that Germany ever like drew um, and second to that I also have a model uh, made by Amazing Hobbies of the Lurver and I'm completely building it out I haven't touched it in a while because I'm waiting to get oh hello is that a swing fire? I think that's a swing fire. Or it's that STRV. Um, but I'm using... I'm waiting to get uh, the metal barrel and brake for the model itself. I'm waiting to get a couple more paints so I can uh, put a fictional camo on it. Oh, what the fuck? And then go along with like the fictional story and lore that I have for this vehicle. I, w I wish I had all the equipment to make model videos because that would have made a, a build progress video on the channel but um it would be out of character for this channel uh, and then i got some camo nets on a, on a wish list and then a couple other things that i want to put on it and make it look cool um, but yeah gaijin please add both the light and heavy version of the panzer Kantewagen 7 I did not think... I thought he pulled away. I did not think it was actually going to get that kill. Lurver to the game, please. I beg of you, that's an STRV or a Centurion. I am dead. British Sabo is not this thing's best friend. Especially when we got a heat boy over here slinging... Well, heat. Yep, I just saw his muzzle... Br bleh, cannot speak... I don't even know what it is. It's right there. It's probably a German bulldog with heat FS. I'm gonna ignore him though and see if I cannot take on this Centurion. Also, if the video got quiet, it's because I turned my headset down because I was trying to talk and the game's loudness was annoying me. It was an STRV. I fucking knew it. That's an IS-2. I don't know why I keep squad pinging. No one can see that. Hey, we already got five kills. I love this tank to death, guys. Like, this, there's a reason why this is my favorite... One of my favorite Tiger 2s. Granted, there's only three. The Porsche... The Porsche version, the Henschel version, and then this one. But I'm going to say hello. And he's dead. God, I love this cannon. Two jets on my ass. Okay, we got one. Luckily, they were both bad at aiming, but these jets aren't going to. Yep, I can already hear one on my right. They're going to get me in a turn and smack me out of the air. Here goes my engine. It only takes a fire in this game to completely take you out of the sky. Yep. That was my fault. I was trying to I was trying to go up and then go down so I could kill that oh, other SP. No. Uh, we'll try it. Oh! I was completely off. It was a T-25. How was that for a shot? That was a good shot. I didn't think I could make that. Never can get a million on the battle trophy. So we ended up second place in the team. 6,100 research points. 68,000. Almost 69,000. Silver Lions. All of our medals. Uh, eight kills. Uh, one was with the HE-219. And one was with the Yag Tiger.
9 crits, 15 hits. I know you guys don't care about that, but for me, it's kind of just extra stats. Got a T-34 or T-29, one of the two. He's dead. Saved our teammate, I think. Reload this slow-ass gun. gonna touch B just to decap get the team get the enemy team moving I probably shouldn't got a engine radiator he's gonna nuke us Okay, he just fired. Okay. Second time isn't the charm. That's okay though, we got out. That's a cool, that's a cool but weird sound at the same time. We're gonna not fuck with that IS-3. Please push through that. Is he a... Okay, he's alive. Can he move, though? I don't know. Bounce it again. Nice. Okay, T... Uh, T-54 killed the IS-3. Okay. Let's, let's take a peek see, shall we? Turn the turret, please. Okay. So IS-2, I'm gonna trust him as much as I don't like trusting teammates. All I hear is T-34 sounds. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I, I expected that not to pen. He shot, right? Doesn't matter. He might... He's definitely going to reload before me. It's just a matter of him not hitting my ch cheeks. He hit my cheeks. Wait, did I have six killed me? He shot me through the gap. Yeah, that's what I thought. Holy shit, I did not think that was going to pen the top of an IS-3. Okay guys, well, I'm going to end the video here. The video's been long enough, and I didn't want to drag it on for, like, another game. Uh, that game was, like, completely over by the time it started. Uh, I, I foresee us losing that game anyways. So, that has been my favorite Tiger 2 that never existed, the Tiger 2 105. This tank is amazing. I would say if you haven't played this tank i would recommend playing it like even if you have it unlocked and you haven't touched it i'd recommend grinding out the modifications for this vehicle and start using it and putting it in your main tiger 2 6.7 lineup because this vehicle is extremely fun to use it's literally just a tiger 2 with a bigger gun and a little bit more armor that's probably placebo it probably doesn't have more armor it just feels like that so if we just go by these stats, that's the hall armor and turret armor. And if we compare it, it's literally the same. But for some reason, the Tiger 2 105 has more survivability than the standard Tiger 2 H and P. So, without further ado, like, come subscribe, ding dong notification bell so you guys know when I upload next, especially on War Thunder content. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Adios.